Welcome back to Star Sector, folks. We are heading out to explore out here and hopefully find some good stuff. Unfortunately, in, I think it was in the last one that uh, Persian League they took over Sulfid Station here in uh, Ruffelkale. Hopefully, Sulfan R&D can take that back because it was kind of nice having that there and not having Persian League there because Persian Leagues are, well, not nice. So, it is what it is. We have absolutely no money. Zero available credits, so we need to find some money. It's as easy as that. Uh, we have a few weapons on us, and we also have two ships in our fleet that uh, we need to sell. But we'll do that a little bit later. So let's uh, head on out there. And see what we find. Hopefully something that we can scavenge. Because we really need that. Some debris over here at least. Something. Do one more. Okay. Now let's ping. Nothing here really, so we'll just head out and head to the next system. This was not the system that would make us switch. Let's head to Beta Toyol. Jump in here, I think. Let's have a look. There's a barren world, volcanic world, and barren world. Okay. Let's make a chance of ping here, I think. Basically, I don't want to spend resources on surveying something that doesn't have ruins because. We need all the resources that we have, all the supplies that we can get our hands on. There's nothing here. So we'll head out. We have a fringe jump point right there. And we'll head on to the next one. Uh, order jump. That's what I want to do. Might just have to grab one of our beta cores and sell that to Fractacion or something. Now Imperium has a wait, afford the jump. What is our relationship to Imperium? Favorable. Okay. So we can go in and have a look. Sell some stuff to them. Mining base, nice. We'll explore that. A nav relay, we'll learn that. Volatiles. Wasn't the greatest mining base in the world, but it's something. their base there. I'm surprised there was a mining base here. There's a debris field down here as well. Let's go check that out first. Before we head to their base. We might as well, right? 
Okay. Anything else here? Doesn't seem like it. There's a small debris field right there. Let's head up to uh, Han for a visit and see if we can make a bit of money. The lack of consistent pay over the last few months has caused discontent among your crew. Okay, I can understand. I can relate that it's not fun working for free. So the harvested organs, actually, I thought we'd sell it all on the black market. So the volatiles, transplutonics, we can get more, way more somewhere else. Uh, they don't have a com relay here. 221 is okay. Metals, that's a horrible buy price. Heavy machinery, that's a horrible price. We're almost full on fuel. We don't really see fleet. Uh, refit, is there any strip you? And then there's you. Eight. So you uh, black market. So you for three thousand one hundred. So you for one thousand one hundred sixteen. Okay. It wasn't a lot, but it was something. All right. So that gives us a little bit of money. Tell a tale of one of your own encounters with death, having fought blah blah blah. Just the amount of drink that's vanishing. Your final point: paying green to let the rest of the fleet know you won. Hmm. Ask a young officer jumps at the opportunity heard about this weird ship from some militia types when I was out drinking at your breasts. Came out of nowhere, lightning fast, no transponder, so they caught up to tell him before the local patrols caught him. We got him in any trouble. Next thing you know, fast picket intercepts and goes in guns blazing. Wiped out that frigate just like that. Didn't want to get involved, so they burned out. Let's find the ship in the Bell Star system, okay? I guess that's a quest. Okay. The Bell Star system, where's that? Oh, it's here. Okay. That's not the frigate. Uh, 
heavy damage sustained subsequent to Vox Echo having Haven unable to continue mission in promised system. Then transmits garbled nav data pointing towards the supposed promise. You know, your navigational systems are thankfully able to calculate the system's location. Review of the ship suddenly erupts in light as several scuttling charges detonate, blowing the ship to pieces. Promise. Okay. What's this promise? This is a story, a promise. Okay. Not there, we can't do that right now. That's just not possible. We can assess here. I think we are going to jump out of here. We might transfer jump. And we'll head down towards Nim. see what's here and also try and find some kind of mission we can do because we desperately need money we desperately need money Station or Osma Station, it is. That's Sophie Station. Eighty nine. I get one hundred and seventy four written over Cup That's much more interesting. Two twenty five. That's the Kadua remnant, and they don't particularly like us, as I recall. Metals. Again, the Kadua remnant. The in the Persian League, no thank you. Uh, 13 light years away in the... Star System Joy. Hmm. Where's Joy? It's right there. There are two pirates and Persian League in there. No. We might have to head down to Nova Capitalis or we'll just sell here. 64. I'm not selling those for 64. Right, what do we have for bounties? Light basic cruiser, strong point cruiser, light stolen destroyer. We can do this. We can definitely do this. This one we can definitely do as well. This one. And not so much. Not so much. Definitely not. Got 77 days on that, and that's more or less on the way to that. So you are... In love with a red primary star. Me, me, your methane world. In a world with a, in a system with a red primary star. Who else? That there was some other bounty there. A pirate base. Mm, the Tia star system. No, I don't think a two hundred and fifty thousand pirate base is viable. 
to be honest. We do know where there are methane worlds in here. Where is Tia? This is Tia. So we need methane world. There's a pirate base there. Lucky Ice World, Petra, Phoenix Falling, Polygon. Okay, so that doesn't have a methane world. That doesn't have a methane world. This has a methane world, Beta Nora. So that's where we're heading. I think I want, before we head there, I want to buy as many supplies as I can afford. More or less, we'll get a hundred. We do have some space on board. We do have enough crew. So, Let's see, 970 units of fuel, nah, that's too far for too little, that is too far for too little. Yeah, so we're not gonna take that one, nothing in there, let's leave. Uh, we were heading down to Beta on Nora. So let's lay in a course for that. How do 9th Battle Group uh, feel about us? Uh, vengeful. Okay. So there's not an option. Uh, Imperium likes us, so we'll head down here. Actually, let's just head back to Osma Station. And we'll sell all this stuff, even though we don't get that much for it. supplies and fill up on fuel that leaves us with 4,000 and we'll head to Beta Nora This does mean that we can't pay our crew fully again, so we'll lose more crew, but hopefully we'll make some money out here so that we can. Now, Beta Anora. Hmm, that was where... I did not want to hit all those storms. That was where... Oh, crap. Well, first of all, it's been a while. Monthly expenses, 30,000. That's a lot. I think this was where... The damned path had a base. Diablo Avionics. We have a sensor array right there. We want to head to the methane world. There she is. Uh, 
minutes. Emergency burn. Try and catch her. And pursue. Let's order the second in command to handle it. And of course, the one ship, the most important one, was the one that we didn't get. So we have to catch her again. We've got a crew. Damn it, where'd you go? Just down there. Right, she's emergency burning. We're emergency burning. And we catch her. We need to catch her. Yes, pursue him. All right, disable. No, thank you. All right, that's 54,000. So that's something. We'll take this apart. And then we will head out. There's a new bounty right there. An Atlas, a Falcon. Well, it's on the way. to be hiding near an auric world in a system with a dwarf primary star. So that would be there. It has an auric world. Up there. We only have two hundred and something supplies left, which is not great. Jump into the fringe jump point, it should be fine. It's a bit far away, we could have jumped in closer. Let's save again, just for good measure. Okay, so A Atlas. Pork, a falcon, and some destroyers. She has blockade runner plus 21%, stable shields minus 14%, shield upkeep, durable mounts, sluggish vents, slow turret gyros, and durable engines. Okay, she's quite good. We want you, you, definitely you. Hmm. I want some screens as well. Uh, 
It takes it down to one star. We'll leave it at two star. Deploy that. Now you support that, 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 you support that. Put up here. To battle we go. Hopefully we get a lot of supplies so that we can go get that other fleet as well. That little thing is gone. Yep. basically gone as well. Don't want to get too far ahead of ourselves. Let's put a strike on the Falcon. Yeah. ready for the next one. Uh, Rima is getting a bit ahead of itself. Feels like. Let's just have a look. That dread is not where I'd like it to be, to be honest. There's the Atlas. I actually want the strike to be on the Atlas. Strike that. The Falcon is over there fighting that guy. Why doesn't why isn't any of his escorts with him? Well there's one, that's a remake. Oh. That guy is taking a pounding. want to do that. Uh, 
Ooh, we have the Falcon right down here. And it's taking a beating. Let's see, do I want to bring you in? I'm actually thinking that I do. I'll turn around and try and deal with this Falcon. Behind me, yes. Little. All right, it's going down. Damn it, that's vent. Wolf retreated. You are flying right through all those enemy ships. I'm not sure that's the best of ideas that we've ever had. The EOS was destroyed. Oh no. That thing is almost down. I want everyone to engage that Atlas. Fleet is defeated. Uh, we'll pursue him. Okay, consider ship recovery. We're definitely recovering you. Structural damage, erratic fuel injector. It's not great. It's a power grid, um, Atlas, structural damage, increased maintenance. Mm, the Hawk, does it even have, it does have fighter base, one. Hmm. Nah. No, we'll recover those two. Click through the wreckage. Take everything. Okay. So that's 122,000 or something like that. Got a level up. I 
I think I'll take the flux. Yeah. And then we have our fleet. Where we have our poor Eos, who needs its pilot back. Okay, but we did it, and we now have 279,000. How did we get that much? Port victory. So let's see. The Dread Eagle plus Volatile Flux Core, that doesn't sound good. The other Dread Eagle plus Durable Engines, that sounds okay. If the EOS has a Spindus crew now, that doesn't sound like a good thing either. Uh, the Tarima has a resourceful crew. The Chape class is a death trap, and the Silica is fragile. Wonderful! Okay, so in increased overload dura duration, that's not great. Increased engine durability, reduced peak performance time, reduced supplies per month, increased crew casualties, reduced hull integrity. Fantastic. So here we have... Hmm. So I did... The rail repeater did a lot. The plasma driver did a lot. Okay. It's pretty good. Pretty good. And we had oh we got an insurance payout for those, but we recovered them. So that's kinda nice that you get their insurance. Even though you recover the ships, that's actually quite nice. So that's why we are up to 279,000. And in the next one, uh, bounties, we'll go check out this bounty over here for 145,000. We have a few days to get it and. There's a basic cruiser, strong point cruiser in the venture, and then some destroyers. I think we should be perfectly capable of doing that. And then there are actually two pirate bases, but I'm not sure we can do these 250,000 pirate bases. It seems... They're probably three-sided pirate bases, right? maybe even uh, battle stations and that seems like too much for us to handle with our current uh, complement of ships so i don't think we'll do that but we'll have to figure it out uh, in the next one so thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed it if you did why not leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you next time